Hi everyone, welcome to Wish Problem. So in this video, we'll be looking at AM5 challenges of trigonometry class 8. So let's begin with challenges. So this AM actually deals with the allied angles, okay? So let's start the first bit. First bit, first question says that we have to find the values of the following, okay? It is cos 580, 5 degree is the first question. So how we can split this? Like we have, we can split it 90 plus theta, 180 plus theta, uh, 270 plus theta, 361 plus theta. Minus also we can do. So I am going to split it like cos 360 plus 225. Okay. Then it will give you 585, right? Yes. Now this will be. Now. You are adding this, right? If you are adding or subtracting, this angle you should take now. 360, no need to consider it. Now what you will do? Write the cos as it is. According to this degree, the value should be same or uh, minus or plus or value should be changed or not. It will differ. So with this challenges and classroom packages, we will get to know you clearly understand this. Okay. Now, so 225 you will write. So it will become cos 225 when you do like this. Now, what we will do is cos 225 can be written as 270 minus 45. So, two se sorry, supposed to write it as 270, right? So, 275 minus 45. Now, there's one more rule when it is cos 275 when you are writing. And this is actually a rule like one. if it is odd multiple. Now, if you have 90. Odd multiple of 90 in the sense you will have same thing. Or uh, if it is even, sorry, even means same thing you will have. Odd in the sense opposite. Okay, fully opposite it will be. Now 90, 180, 270 and 360 is there. Right. So 90 multiples in the sense 1 into 2 into. So sorry, you can't write like this, right? So 90 in the sense is nothing but 1 into 90. 180, 2 into 90. 270, 3 into 90, 364 into 90. So here you can observe 1 and 3. These two are odd multiples and these two are even. So whenever you're dealing with 180 and 360, it will the value won't change. The ratio will be same and it will be positive. When you're dealing with nine odd numbers, it will become negative and cos will become sign tag cos. Sorry, it is like cos sign no so in both ways and tan will become cot secant will become cosecant and cosecant will become d so that's why arrow mark divided so this will become minus sign into uh, this will be 45 right then as a minus sign is nothing but minus 1 by root 2 now we'll see the next one to say uh, question is secant 5 10 degree Right, so this question is of the same way how we have done. So this one we will do with 360 only, 360 plus 150. There's no only single way, like only have to take 360 only. There's no rule like that. Or uh, you can take 180 plus 90 minus, like that also you can take 90 plus. So now 130 is convenient for me, so I have choose. So it's your wish, whatever you want to choose, you can choose. Okay, but it should be written compulsorily. So, if you take this even multiples in the sense, this value will be same. That's why I took most of, I pre, uh, tell you to prefer even multiples most of the time. Okay, then you won't get confused. Now, second 150, you can write that as 90 plus 60, you know? now 1 into 90. That is the odd multiple. So, this will draw become minus cosecant. 60 right just now i explained that also it is minus 2 by root 3 now we will see third one third bit is sine 5 pi by a uh, 3 c that is the degree right it's so, like value unit i can say now this pi is nothing but 180 right so first we have to simplify for getting the angle first so, 5 into 180 by 3 
then 3, 6, 18, right? 16. Now, it is 300 degrees, right? Yes, sine 300. Now, we have to solve actually. Okay, so sine 300 in the sense, 360 minus 60 we can write, right? Yes. Now, sine 60. Uh, everything I explained, so directly I am just solving. So, minus it is there because value due to sine, right? That's why it is minus. Now, minus root 3 by 2. That's it. Now, we will see next one. Fourth question, that is tan 2 pi by 3. Sorry, minus, okay? Then, so this is the given question. Actually, the question minus is here, but we can bring that to front. No, so minus tan 2 pi by 3. Right, <clears throat> so now pi value is obviously 180 only. So 2 into 180 by 3, 360 as it is, and minus tan 120. So, 120 value, we don't know. We will take it as minus 10, 180 minus 60. So, that would be a plus, plus 60. Okay, then it is root 3. Now, we will see second but subdivision in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Like, share and subscribe to Vishwa Blooms.